Hey guys! In this episode of King Guy, we have Jane. Hi. And uh, maybe many of you don't know her role and being in my life, but she has been taking care of me for the last 10 years almost. <laughs> I need to have her on King Guy because she is actually taking care of a huge part of my life, which is my work site. Lah. And of course, as a personal friend as well, she rendered her support in all these years. So yeah, I thought we'll chit chat a little bit more with her. So um, Jane and I, right, got to know each other mm. through an agency, lah. Okay, not like friend making agency, <laughs> <laughs> matchmaking. <laughs> <no>. <laughs> she was working in the agency I was with previously. Then she was my manager when she. Ni joined just the manager, lah, right? And then after how many years you quit? I two zero quit two one four. So she quit earlier part of two zero one four or so after she's been taking care of me for about three years plus yeah. lah. And the thing is, the only relationship I cause she's like our nanny, our so called babysitter and manager, right? So she takes care of everything so well that I just feel like I don't think I can handle so well without her lah. So she continued to help take care of my other work all the way until you were doing a blog shop, right? All my own self liars one. Uh, Yeah. Actually, that's the whole thing. I thought I just like would try out because this is for blog shop. I mean, I guess it'll be more like I'll be able to cope. These were the days well. of blog shop, okay, by so, the way. So, it's a dinosaur age. Then. Yeah, and then I mean, working with you, I mean, the past two or three years at a time, I thought, I mean, it was easy and like okay. So, I mean, I just. Don't compliment okay, yourself. Okay. <laughs> I thought it should be, I mean, it shouldn't be different. From how it was uh, in the in the agency, so I thought like okay, can give it a try. Then each one year, you can. Now it's been ten years. Right. Ten years. So um, do you want to share with them like when you first came to the firm? Yeah. Like how do you feel about me or everyone or whatever? I guess like you know initially because that was my first job, right? Yeah. I was very you know a bit starstruck lah because right before that I was very into like reading blogs, looking at like tell me this before videos <laughs> and all that. So whenever I see anybody like. Okay, Benjamin or what, right? I was like, oh my god, I first time see him, eh. and then I'm like the Baumo now, you know, a bit excited. And then when I met you, at that time you were known as Budget Babi, uh, so I was thinking, oh my god, I'm gonna meet you too soon. Will she be like really like Budget Babi in real life, very kiam kai or you know very sertian kai? I mean, I never know what. Uh, that's all first impression, right? So at that time when I was in the company, I think you had a lot of overseas trips and all that, uh, and I guess you were really very like generous, you know. Although like the trips were you know by the company. Or even sometimes it was from yourself, you know, like your your referrals and all that. Something that really warmed my heart was when each time when you come on a trip, right? You will definitely buy a lot of goodies. It's not just for me. It's like really for the entire company, even for people who are working back end. At that time, you know, me and my colleagues were like, oh my god, she's very nice and yeah. like like she I like to really, do that lah. Yeah, she's really like a very generous person. Which I just like to shop. <laughs> okay lah, yeah. Maybe you over shop, but you know, to us is really an extra mile lah because you don't have to do that. You can always give to like. Your friends and family. Yeah, time. I will buy one big set yeah. for my family because my family like kampung, mm. right? Yeah. Then I'll buy one big set for my agency company. Okay, so that was just one example, and then after that, you know, when we meet for like events and all that, right? I guess initially I was still like, okay lah, better be professional a bit, right? But then you know when we were even talking casually, you start to like burp and fart. Then I was like. Yen lai zhe ge ren, like you need to talk to. So I guess like you know usually you need to do that when you are close to your friends and all that. Yeah. So it feels like you really like open up to and you are really like who you are. Even when you are on live now, yeah. like, you don't talk like that. Like, yeah, yeah. Shocking. No, it's not because of me. Maybe if I meet you like just now, 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 No me. <laughs> no me. Such a bonding. <laughs> <laughs> so I okay. I guess the takeaway, the key takeaway here is, you want to make someone feel comfortable, you just fart in front of them. <laughs> not all the time. Not for dates. Not for dates. I'm just saying. <laughs> Actually, joining the firm was also a huge part of my working adulthood. Yes, like growing up. Yeah, you know? yeah. So I think you you are the saving grace. Hi, I was in your face. You put P. You imagine that time I didn't put that P. Then you feel like the normal, 
no, then you'll be like the other, I mean, normal bloggers or what, right? Right. 我以后真的是多见人要多放屁。Uh, please don't do that. You're really doing your life. 你们那些 a crew 谁想跟我 next level 就来。Actually, you heard before, right? You never heard before, me? Heaven, ah. You can. 后面那个。For working lunch, for example, uh. you will order your own. I will order my own, right? But sometimes you will ask like, "Oh, do you want to have something?" Which is very normal. Everybody will do that, right? But you see, but you cannot touch the whole rice, ah. The rice I must finish oh. my own. Like that's my favorite, ah. You, I think it's very funny because like you will disclaim first. You know when it's like first few lunches, uh, people will be like a bit pious, they like, "Oh, you can have some, you know, try." They will just say a little right? But after you say, you will also disclaim like, "What is your favorite? Cannot touch whatever. Which are the things that you don't share with people?" Yeah, actually, what happened is to my closer friends, mm. right? They will all know. Like I freaking love my carbs. Yeah lah, that means that that's why I felt comfortable already after that. So I can also do the same and tell you what I like to share, what I don't share. <laughs> So, cause like I feel like as my workload was piling up, right? I just feel like I need someone I can trust who really take care of me, lah. Throughout all these years, right? Jane really do a very good job. You all know why? Because right, my PC is not very good. No, no, no. We have not been angry at you. Yes, yes, yes. I am when something happens. 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 I am when I would just, I think I, would, I guess, I guess I would just be listening here, let you rant it all over. Then I say, okay, go back to the same topic. You're always like that. All these years, lah. Okay, then she would just like, so I just tell them for you, lah. Then how do you her nicely, professionally wrap it up? You know, in a like like present, you know, like inside I'm the part of shit. Like ah, and then she's like, that. okay, let me wrap it up nicely with ribbons and a sweet note, <laughs> specially for you. So she plays that role in my life, and it's very important because obviously not professional, right? Of course not lah. <laughs> I guess I think cause like we are like close enough, so I'm just able to share anything. I I feel a huge part of my life is really work or not. I won't say work lah. Mm, it's yeah. like the career path I choose yeah, yeah. right? So become she is the one who's taking care of that part, you know. I feel like my online stuff, like the work, the whatever, it's actually very inter, yeah. like link lah. It's very mm. related with my actual life. So she takes care of that part. That means actually she takes care of a huge part of my life. Sunny, I think it's very important. You, 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 I think maybe people don't know you as a person Why can you be so important? For example, I really think you can see what kind of person you can see What kind of person you can see It actually makes them Part of you makes me Part of whoever hanging around me makes me So maybe you should introduce Let them know about yourself Personally, in my personal life, I have two daughters The age group is actually quite close to Tio's daughter Yeah, my first daughter's age is the same as Amelia And then even my second daughter my daughter is the same as Oliver yeah. And my family, I have two older sisters When I was young, I was already very close to my family Especially close to my second sister and my mom. Yeah, I guess that's all about my personal you, you see, family right? This is like, to her, she's just saying Oh, this is just my life like this But to me, whenever I look at her and the people around me right, I feel you guys are such amazing people It's like you don't even know oh. <laughs> I know we don't have this time But I really think that I think this is the same thing But what made you so like Wow, you're doing a lot of professional You're doing a lot of work You're doing a lot of work You're doing a lot of work I guess like when it comes to working like with you, okay, especially like a work, and then it's important like to know your style. I think most importantly is, I mean, sometimes I, I I'm forgetful when I am part of like you know other work, especially. I guess the most important thing is really just to be truthful to you. You know, sometimes when you ask, I just you know, like let you know, okay, what's on my plate and all that. I guess communication yeah. is key lah for both yeah. of us, right? That sort of you know brings us closer together because if I never tell you like you know what's going on with my life as well, I think you also wouldn't be so understanding and yeah. all that. Do you wanna let people know how does it feel like? Uh, I think like after letting you know like for example a difficult 
scenario or whatever that we face it at work right you will definitely have your rants and you also like share like what you did I guess the important thing is we're all like working moms so it's important to get the right timing to know when to yeah, respond yeah, 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 because yeah, that's true. like you know for me I guess like when I talk to you about work or even about myself you know when I want to contact you we won't expect a reply immediately right we just like message you whenever you're free you will reply or whenever I'm free I'll reply you and then we know that we are most active at night you know especially after, after the kids, the kids. Are gone or you know, I mean, yeah. no, I'm asleep sleeping, not gone, <laughs> sleeping or you know after the uh, after we complete like our important tasks yes. yeah, I mean, at home or at work then I guess night time is really like the season of the time BTW, she's also the one that like makes it half through the day to me, she'll call my husband. That's the ultimate term. Yeah, uh, since I'm here later, I'll get a Suzy's number. So. <laughs> so so this part um is quite interesting for me la. Mm. I and I just want to share with people. You marry your first boyfriend. Official. I mean but before him, unofficial, I got one or two la, like that. <laughs> okay, so yeah. official, you marry your first official yeah. boyfriend, yeah. and then you guys have two kids. Yes. And how has having kids changed you as a person? I guess like having kids really make me more responsible. When I was just with my husband, right, we really had no commitment. So, you know, in terms of spending, in terms of like going out for cafe hopping and all that, we really just spend and then like really enjoy ourselves thoroughly. After having kids, you know, we have more responsibility when it comes to our expenditure because we need to set aside for the education. When it comes to uh, spending time together, we really rarely have dates unless it's special occasions. I know we need to find time. Awesome. But then, right now the kids are still young, so I would say right after work is really putting them to sleep, you know, then when they wake up and all that. Although I have a helper now, she really helped me a lot, but after having kids, I guess our lifestyles are really different. It really revolves around the kids. That sometimes we need to remind ourselves that, you know, before the kids actually come, we still have... That's consoling ourselves. He's a very bad person. <laughs> I think that's why we can work together okay, okay. Because oh, I tell you something Sometimes our posts are like even in my delivery ward mm-hmm. Or even when I am like doing confinement Even if I just given birth The day I give birth, the day after All this time I'm, I'm working And mm-hmm. that's what you see because I share right But what you don't know is It's the same for the person behind me and supporting my work which is <laughs> Jane la. And this is how I feel we can you know, work so long together Just that mm-hmm. they are very bad Although I am bad, sometimes I will cry Is it not cry? Or maybe he cry to other people, I don't know Oops You can't cry because you cry Really? He is that kind of character You have that mother feeling Yeah, although Okay, I really remember my age But I guess a lot of people think I'm much older than that still She's younger than me, she's like my main mate's age But she takes care of me like she's like my mother <laughs> I'm not very happy about that <laughs> I wouldn't want to be your <laughs> Moving forward, right? Mm. All the different roles you play in life. Yep. Is there anything you look forward to? I guess like moving forward, right? I would really want to try to strike a balance between like work and life. I guess in the past before kids, it's really all about like work. You know, after having kids, I realized like you know what a family is. It. My parents are also aging and all that. I feel that like quality time with family is very important. In the upcoming years, what I really hope to have is to strike a balance mm. between work and life. Cause other than working to earn money, I feel that you know life is not just about money and all that. Uh, having like quality time with friends and family is equally important. Yeah. So I, I hope to like you know have like a chongzhi life with my loved ones. Hey, wait, 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 wait. In case they don't know, she's not just like helping me with work. Lor. She has her own work. One. Yeah. She has <laughs> her own work. So so in case you men feel that I work hard, I'm not doing work. No, no, no. 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 So yeah. I feel like I totally mm. see what you're saying because don't forget to leave. Yeah. We should actually keep some time to like you know pamper ourselves at the same time as right. in, it's really just to relax and to re-energize for our work and family. So it's very All the mummies out there, you know, all ladies la, like generally just take care of yourself yeah. as well. If without help, we wouldn't be able to enjoy like the fruits of our labor. Time sometimes, 真的是 is just taken away like that. 对，小孩子就这样，嘣一长大了。长大了。爸爸妈妈这样，嘣一老了。Yeah. 你知道吗？对啊，对啊。So I because we got talk about this before lah,、mm-hmm. like about how we want to do something that、mm-hmm. allow us to have more time with our kids. Yes. And that's how we are. So kids and work focus. Yeah. So 两个真的是要抓一个平衡， yeah. 你知道吗 ？I guess like maybe because we're also at the like same stage of life, 对不对？ 
up. But I think I think she is a more sophisticated version of no. how the juggle should be, you know. I'm just like all over the place. But yeah, I, I mean, I, I just want to let people know mm. that you are freaking amazing and important. <laughs> and I think maybe sometimes you don't even know, mm. right? Mm. But yeah, now you guys know Jane <laughs> is a huge part of my life for 10 years. So like last time, right, she always end off her email with Jay and everybody thought it's Joshua. Now also, actually now also. Yeah, Jay, then oh, make her, if they do it, they will do it. They will do it. They will do it. So it's Joshua, Joshua taking care of all your emails and work uh. email and stuff. I was like, no, uh, it's Jane. Because they might think I'm a person who's 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 a person for tuning in to this episode of King Kai. Please leave a comment in the comment section to tell us who you want to see next and we will try to arrange, okay? Say bye-bye too. Bye-bye! Thank you for coming. Thank you! Bye!